getting around takes longer than it used to. It's hard to get out. But independence comes with pride, which makes what happened to Jackie Bartlett upsetting. It was very upsetting. Feel more violating. That went on for seven months. I don't understand why somebody didn't know that, though. That's a long time. She says the now former business manager at her independent living home overlooking White Rock Lake stole 15,000 of her dollars, a lot of money. Some people, I guess, had to be a drop in the bucket, but not for me. And it wasn't just her. We just kept finding them, uh, so many of them. Molly Terry's mom lives here. Terry put the pieces together. She says the assembled puzzle revealed a scam that affected at least 30 seniors, adding up to tens of thousands of dollars. It came out to about $67,800. Was what, I, was what I got. She says the employee told people to make their rent checks out to a different LLC, one, Terry says, that was registered to the employee's home. She signed her actual name and then mobile deposited them on her phone. The facility, Autumn Leaves, tells us in a statement, quote, we were shocked and outraged by the allegation that a former employee may be involved in misappropriating resident and company funds. And we remain committed to serving seniors and fostering a culture of compassion, collaboration, and trust. They say no resident will have to repay the money. Dallas police are investigating, but no one has been charged. And I have heard of this happening in other places, but you just think it won't happen to you. When it does, it breaks trust and pride. In Dallas, I'm Cole Sullivan.